This is Dennis. And believe it or not, this is Dennis's house. Dennis likes to get rid of things. Dennis, I understand you had a Van Gogh once. I did, that's true. And what did you do with it? I threw it out. It uh, cluttered my walls. But uh, you have no walls. Nope, got rid of them. Why? Nothing to hang on them. And you had a cat once, right? Yeah, you know what I did with him? Let me guess, you got rid of him. No, no, he, uh, he ran away. But you do like to throw things out. My mom always told me to do what I'm good at. Just thought I'd throw that out there. Okay. Uh, Dennis, what we're really talking about today is parking lots and how to keep harmful materials from getting into our rivers and lakes. Dennis, do you know what happens to the oil and grit that gets onto the lot? It vanishes. Spills? Poof. Old metals? Oh, I like those. What? Why? Shiny things distract me. All right. If you own or manage a commercial property like a mall, a factory, an apartment building, or a parking lot, you are responsible to make sure the oil and other waste in the runoff does not end up in the natural environment. How? Well, you need an oil and grit separator. What is an oil and grit separator? <laughs> Great question. It's a device that's installed under roads and parking lots that's tied into the city's stormwater system. When water goes down the storm drain, the separator takes out sediment, screens debris, and separates the oil. Why? Because the only things that are supposed to be going into our storm sewers are rainwater and melted snow. All of that water flows directly into our creeks, rivers, and lakes. Anything else that goes down the sewers, like oil, metals, spills, and other stuff is bad news. So what do you have to do? <laughs> That's easy. Just inspect your separator once a year and clean it regularly. And if you do that, everything will be fine. If you don't, you'll be breaking the law and you may be responsible for toxic runoff, going into our storm drains, harming our wildlife and water environment. Got questions? Just ask. Don't be like Dennis. Maintain your separator, and it will put oil and grit waste in the right place. You'll be saving our sewers and protecting our environment too.